students of the Calvinist dormitory in Kuholm in Sekloland learn folk dances, Hungarian population of the small town in southern Transylvania has been in so much of a decline since the 1990s that the persistence of Hungarian language education is at risk. The dormitory established 20 years ago ventures upon assuring his persistence. However, the institution is the only one providing mother tongue education for the Hungarian youth of the surrounding region. The dormitory provides not only homely accommodation, but teaches Christian values to the students and organizes community programs to them. Dominik Kovács is a performer of historic arts and crafts. He teaches archery and handicrafts for the youth. He maintains that history and culture may be taught and even endured to the children through lasting experiences. I think that the youth in Hungary knows too little about the situation here in the diaspora, he said. He emphasized that the problems of the diaspora should be brought to public notice in Hungary. This is the small town of Nagymoha, some 30 kilometers from Kuhalom. The isolated South Transylvanian village is inhabited by some 300 people, of whom 90% are Hungarians. The young Petrovi scholarship holder holds lectures once a week here as well. Children love and are in need of these activities, said the local curate. Time will tell if these children as adults will speak Hungarian or assimilate into the surrounding Romanian-speaking population. However, one thing is sure, these communal activities and the Hungarian language school play a vital role in preserving their identities.